Nearly one year after a deadly fire broke out at a migrant detention center in Juarez, Mexico, which killed 40 and injured another 27, a new report suggests staff may have knowingly kept detainees locked inside a holding cell as the blaze raged on. Right after the fire, officials claimed the keys to the cell could not be located in order to let out the migrants. But now a new investigation by Lighthouse Reports, along with La Verdad and El Paso Matters, reveals that the key to the detainee's cell was inside the facility until moments before the fire. Surveillance footage captured a staff member allegedly refusing to open the cell. According to the report, a security guard handed the key to a colleague who put it in his pocket. Audio captured a uniformed National Migration Institute member allegedly saying, we are not going to open the cell for them. I already told those guys, as she appeared engrossed in her phone. Despite mounting evidence, the National Migration Institute has yet to comment on the report. Nine individuals, including federal and state agents, face charges. The commissioner at the time remains in his position despite the criminal charges he's facing.